This is try eight of trying to recreate my Coraline inspired soap from last year. And I'm just gonna run through this really, really quickly because I did infinitesimal changes and it required infinitesimal results. And so we're just going to scrap all this. Now this is try nine of my Coraline inspired soap. Before this try, I went back to my original recording last year that I have on YouTube and I studied it. I put on my glasses and I went to work. Last year, I didn't have my double boiler. So I'm going to be doing this in the microwave. Second of all, I poked some holes in the black layer before pouring the light pink layer. So I didn't pour them one right after the other. It looks like I let the black layer harden up a little bit before I poured the pink layer. So we're going to go ahead and do that. I remember this specifically. I waited 10 minutes in between pouring the light pink layer, the vermilion and the chartreuse. So we're going to be waiting 10 minutes. Now it's just down to the temperatures. These ones I did at 135 and then 150 and 150 for the pink vermilion and chartreuse. So we're going to be going through that and I will see you tomorrow for the cut of try nine of the Coraline inspired 